Hi everybody. So somebody asked me what he could do about um, all the stutterings and hiccups he gets when he plays games on his Ryzen APU. And I just told him what I do is I set a fixed multiplier for the CPU frequency and that prevents the CPU frequency from jumping around like not it did now. It went down to 550 megahertz, which is just ridiculous. So with a fixed CPU ratio, you pre prevent the CPU from doing it and you have a nice frame times. That's the graph you see there with the spikes and those spikes are the damn hiccups. So, and uh, <coughs> why is that? If I don't really know the technical details because it's pretty much low level. Uh, could probably be fixed with a microcode update or a BIOS update, not driver, I think. The thing is AMD's algorithm to determine uh, or to set the CPU again, such a bad stuttering again, uh, to s again, it went down to 10 frames per second, which is ridiculously bad. So the, that algorithm that uh, says what frequency the CPU should get depending on load, it fucking sucks when it comes to games. It's really, it's just bad. I see them Raymond Rich laptops. So many games are un unnecessarily unplayable because of that. If AMD would allow the user to just set a fixed frequency, it could be even as low as two gigahertz. It would already be very helpful. Um, it would solve the problem. So um, yeah, that's what you can do. The problem is this guy who asked me he has a mainboard, an Asus mainboard with a A320 chipset, which doesn't allow you to overclock it or fix um, set a fixed multiplier or setting multipliers in general. So you cannot underclock it either. And uh, there's a solution for that, I found, which I found out. <laughs> and that is you can download Asus AI Suite, the software you see on the right. You find it on the Asus mainboard. Uh, Asus mainboard product page, uh, support page, downloads, tools, and uh, there is a um, this tab. I think it's a EPU tune or something, where you can set voltages and also the multiplier. So this uh, tool will not allow you to overclock the your CPU, your APU on a. A320 chips and mainboard, but it will allow you to underclock it and to set it to a fixed ratio. So I will do it. I will set it to 3.37.75. And now you can see on the left side the frequency is fixed, static to 3.7 gigahertz. And Surprise, surprise, we don't have any big stutterings anymore and you can play much better. It won't help me because I'm still bad in this game, but at least those who have some skills, they can now play nicely, even on a mainboard with an A320 chipset. By Asus. I don't know, maybe there are others. Um, maybe MSI has a similar tool that somehow allows you to do that, to set a fixed uh, multiplier, but well, that's for Asus. And yeah, and uh, logically, that also works for all other main boards where you can set a multiplier. And really, you don't have to overclock it, um, especially if you use the IEGPU. It's um, the CPU is enough for the GPU. You can also increase the clock speed a little more. What you cannot do is to go above, I think to go above 38, because then you come in the range of overclocking and then it will fall back in the old behavior. And you can see now the frequency again jumps all over the place. And if we go sub, 38 it works again yeah so that was this fix let me know if you like videos like that and you know the story blah 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 like subscribe blah, blah. do whatever you want see ya